when you've been in the business for a long time though, was there a part of you that kind of had to like, you know, pinch your skin, but you know, when you've been in the industry for a lot of years, you know, you got to be cool and you fit in and it's, you do the work to get in the room, as I always say, but, but like you just said, you and Lee got along incredibly well. Uh, what was that part of it? Like when you first sang with them? Well, it was a bit, it was a bit, as you can imagine, it was a bit surreal, you know, uh, it's it sort of like kind of dropped out of the sky to me. I mean, I, I, I've had a great career. You know, I've been a, a, like a session guy, a studio guy for, you know, 30 years, you know, more than uh, probably approaching 11 or 12,000 recording sessions at this point in time, a lot of time in the studio working on a lot of records and a lot of advertising and film and television. And, you know, this was just like, Oh, okay. You know, I, I like to keep my chops up, you know, and I always enjoyed the voices of all three guys, the original members, you know, Robert, and of course, Terry, who was heavily influenced by Ray Charles, you know, which I always dug. And of course, Peter, you know, I mean, you know, Peter's the guy. I mean, Peter's iconic, you know, masterful singer. So I always enjoyed sort of covering those sounds and those voices, like I've done, you know, everybody from Andrea Bocelli to Joe Cocker and everything in between. But, you know, standing on a stage with them and performing that material was just, I don't know, there was, a, there was a great deal of excitement from my perspective, a huge adrenaline rush. But at the same time, I was, I was very calm about it because mm -hmm. it was just, I mean, the music is everything. And, you know, I had known this music since I was a teenager and was very familiar with the entire catalog and just to sort of get my teeth into it and put my, my own spin on it and, while sort of still staying between the lines, you know, and, and honoring those moments that need to be honored in the songs. It was just, uh, just wonderful. I mean, there's, there's no other words for it. Just a, a kind of thank you, God, you know, 